Here's another question. Why do we get sick sometimes? <laughs> the Flat Earth Corner! Why do you get sick? Well, you've come to the right place. Welcome to medieval Europe. We've got all the filth, disease, and plague you've ever wanted. So where do you go when you get sick? That's right, me, your friendly neighborhood, Barber. As any good barber will tell you, you get sick because of evil spirits. And the best way to get rid of evil spirits? Drain your blood, of course. Hey, come back. I thought I heard you sniffle. I can bleed that cold right out of you. Trust me, I'm your barber. Forget evil spirits. Nowadays, we know that germs make us sick. Now, here's the next question from Logan. What do germs look like? Sorry to be rude, it's just that I've got a lot of germs for you to look at. Here, I'll just use my handy Super zoom -o -matic. I can't make any sense of that, but I know someone who can. Please welcome my special guest, germ expert, Caitlin Soy. Hi. Hi, Harrison, how are you? Good. I brought you something today. I'm a little old for stuffed toys, I think. This isn't a stuffed toy. This is one of the deadliest viruses we know, Ebola virus. I think I'm a little young to die also. So these are stuffed toys of germs. So do germs such as like the chicken pox, do they actually have like a red thing and like two really big eyes and stuff? No, they don't. These are just toys. But different viruses and different bacteria, they do look different from each other. They don't just actually look like this. This is what viruses and bacteria really look like. Chicken pox is often a disease that we get in childhood. Yeah. I don't know if you had it. I remember having chicken pox and I had the rash all over my body with those itchy, itchy spots. Uh, not, not very fun. fun. 